We are underway. The first possession here at the brand new arena. Powell catch and shoot. Not close on the three, and Booker with the rebound. Clippers are 0 4. The Clippers coaching staff has raved about the competitiveness of James Harden on the defensive end so far in camp. Beal lets it fly, and it's good. A three ball for Bradley Beal. And now Royce O'Neal, who was a pickup last February by Phoenix, hits Booker, who misses in transition. But there's Durant to get it to Plumley for two. Shots in the middle area of the floor. Year six for Mann out of Florida State. Booker for three. No good. He's 0 for 2. Man with the rebound. Booker last year sixth in the league in scoring at 27 points per game. Try to draw a charge. He's Phoenix's third head coach in the last three years. Frank Vogel last year. Monty Williams two years prior. Williams led the Suns to the finals back in 2021. And the Clippers are two for 14 from behind the arc. Lead is 10 for Phoenix. Booker for three. And Devin Booker with his first points. The lead is 13 for Phoenix. Close to the basket as you can get. You'll see them standing there. There's a guy with a drum down there at the moment. So the earlier you get here, the faster you can get a seat down low. Sue bots with the rebound off the Jones miss. Clippers have numbers, and Booker breaks up the alley-oop attempt. That's hard to do against the high-flying Jones. It's a great play by Devin Booker. He anticipated that all the way, saw Derrick Jones. He knew where Derrick Jones was going to want that basketball, and he was able to get up there and deflect it. And then he cans a three. So Devin Booker, he was really appreciated for it. Booker off balance, turns it over. And here's Mann in the open floor. Takes it all the way, count it. To the corner, Tyus Jones. Drives and hits over Zubas. Jones' his first season in Phoenix. They needed a point guard. They went out and got one to combine with Beal, Durant, Booker. And Nurkic, Jones in his 10th NBA season, was with Washington last year, four years with Minnesota. And the Clippers able to convert those into easy points, and they're going to need to generate easier opportunities in transition to stay in this game. I'm really impressed with their fight and determination right now defensively, making it really difficult. Good defense by Booker to allow Durant to come back. Durant gets the steal. Harden is hurt. Colliding with Durant. Booker can't finish. The tip is good though by O'Neal and Harden is still down. The way he's playing right now is that how he has to play for this Clippers team to win without Kawhi Leonard. I think ultimately that's but their defense has to trigger opportunity to give him enough offense and they've done that so that he can play more selectively when he wants to attack. Like and the Clippers lead by five and a backcourt violation. A mental mistake by the... Meanwhile, first points for Durant in 18 minutes. Harden gets the steal, goes right at Booker, did not get a whistle. Meanwhile, a brick by Royce O'Neal. No threes this quarter for Phoenix. Harden comes up short with the shot, Booker with the rebound. No threes this quarter for Phoenix. Harden comes up short with the shot, Booker with the rebound, looking to run. Durant in transition, soars to the rim and scores. Powell trying to get free and fouled by Devin Booker. That's three on him and four team fouls on Phoenix. Curling into the foul line area. He doesn't settle for threes on that shot. He wants to get a mid-range. Durant drills the three. You mentioned that we haven't seen that run yet. Booker has only taken six shots the entire game. Made two. That's out of bounds. Another Phoenix turnover. The 18th. 88-79, Clippers with a nine-point lead, their largest of the game. They came back from 14 down. The best defensive possessions in the second half give up the offensive rebound, which leads to a prayer at the end of the clock. Booker with the answer. First basket in a while for Devin Booker. The health of Jaden Daniels with your guys' commanders. That'll be the first question. We'll get to the game eventually that we just <laughs> covered. Turnover out of the timeout. The Suns in transition get a basket from Booker, so that's five straight for him. Big and physical for the guys guarding him right now. Durant short, rebound Harden. That's his 12th board. Coffee, four of four from the floor, gets it swatted away by Durant, but a foul on Booker. That's five. Devin Booker staying in the game with five personal fouls 11 points, five assists, just eight shot attempts for Booker. He'll step back and fire and connect. Swishes home a three. He's four. 
The supporting cast around James Harden a little different this year as Booker misses a free throw again in front of that wall. James Harden just throws him with his off arm. Again, overwhelming the, the Suns guards. But look, we, they don't have Kawhi Leonard, but it's going to be James. But Harden will be the guy determining where this ball goes and makes a bad decision right there. Numbers for the Suns. Jones in transition, takes it all the way and scores, and it's a one-point game. Suns have a foul to give. And Devin Booker just fouled out. Nobody's open. Now here's Harden, and he lost the ball. He couldn't handle it. And the Suns escape with a 116-113 win in overtime. Harden could not handle the inbound pass.